Hello, my name is Sam Kennedy with Crestron, and today I wanted to share with you some new exciting updates coming to the Air Media. Now, many of you would be familiar with Air Media because it's one of the leaders in the wireless content space, where I'm able to share content to the screen, leveraging things like AirPlay and Miracast and the Crestron app. But we've added three new big features that I'd like to share with you today. So the first one is the new Air Media Connect. Now, this one is now shipping. We're really excited about that. But what this brings is a very easy workflow to share content to the screen. All a user has to do is take the USB-C, plug it into your personal device, and I'm able to share content to the screen. It really couldn't be any easier. The second big announcement that we've recently made is the ability to leverage wireless conferencing over the Air Media Connect. Well, what does that mean? Well, if I have an Air Media connected to a device that brings in the microphone camera speakers, in this case, we have the great Crestron SB1 connected to the Air Media. Well, what would happen is when I plug this into my personal device, it will take all that great audio and video and configure my, my laptop in this case. It'll pass all that audio and video and I don't have to do anything on my laptop. I'm gonna give you a quick demonstration of this to show you how easy it is. And the third key point is that Crestron has been partnering with Microsoft to bring some bring your own device capabilities to Microsoft Teams. Now, traditionally, when it came to Microsoft Teams in the conference room, there was a full collaboration device that would be needed, a full Microsoft MTR, which of course Crestron's one of the leaders in. But with the proliferation of bring your own device, Microsoft is adopting that as part of their strategy. So Crestron and Microsoft have been co-developing some new software that will run on the Air Media that delivers that continuum of experiences. So where I have one user interface for Microsoft Teams rooms in some rooms, in other rooms where I have a bring your own device workflow, you'll get the consistent UI. So you can see behind me the Microsoft UI that brings in the calendar for that room. I can see the name and the time. I also see the ability to share content. And so the idea is that for all of those organizations that need some rooms with a dedicated Teams room and some rooms where you need to bring your own device workflow, that we now have that full continuum of experiences. So let me show you this in action. So I'm gonna take the Air Media Connect here. I'm gonna plug it into my laptop over USB-C. And now that once I'm connected, it's going to be able to share my what's on my laptop to the screen behind me. So it was just that simple. I plug the Air Media Connect into my PC. I'm never one now, it was able to see my content. But if I wanna join a meeting, when I click the join meeting button here, um, it's gonna bring me into my Teams. I'm gonna go and click the join, bring me right into my meeting. And now I'm able to see Nina that's connected on the far end. I didn't have to plug in any, I didn't have to configure my Teams client. I didn't have to add a bunch of software. It really was that simple. All I did was take the Air Media Connect, plug it into my laptop, and I'm able to not only share content and everyone can see that on the screen, I'm able to configure and take over the microphone camera speakers that's in the great Crestron SB1 that's connected to the Air Media. It just couldn't be simpler than that. So hopefully this was a really great experience for all of you to see how great the Air Media and the Air Media Connect is. Please go to www.crestron.com to learn more.